Hello again. Fragile Memories is back with another, uh, <laughs> really bad paint job. You'll see what I mean by the end. I found a shell at Hobby Lobby on clearance. I have a little bit of gesso when I took this show-off clip, because I kind of forgot to do that before I started. Very professional of me, I know, thank you. So yeah, here just comes the uh, first layer of gesso. Super exciting. This entire project was just one big struggle after another. Like, later on when I'm trying to blend, I have, like, paint underneath that's peeling up. Probably because I've used too much water and I didn't let it dry enough. So, it was my own fault. I'm well aware of that, but that does not make it any less frustrating. Also, that is a very deep curve in there. And it was very hard to paint. And I wanted to make sure that... Everything underneath that lumpy part, I don't know what you want to call that, but I wanted to make sure that when I sat it down, you couldn't see like parts of the shell underneath that. So I probably went a lot deeper than I needed to to begin with as well. But yeah, here comes me struggling to paint it and blend it. And I did a lot of the blending off camera because it was just kind of easier with the setup to try and do that, and it still took me a good couple days to get something that I sort of liked. Yeah, I wasn't kidding. It was a big struggle. It probably took way longer than what I should have to get this done. And my first thought with this was I was going to paint the other side of it and do like bright pinks and oranges and purples and make like a sort of sunset or beach type theme. But I also thought, well, when it comes to seashells, everyone does beach themes. Wouldn't it be ironic to do a winter scene? Yeah, I painted a late day snow pile. I like the idea, I just don't like the execution. And I wanted to add some color in, so here I am struggling to add any bit of color in here. But I'm not liking anything I'm doing, so eventually I, off camera... Tried a few other things. Didn't like any of that. So I ended up splattering some stars on there. And then I went back with my dotting tool. And I dotted some colors for like bigger colorful stars. And it probably wasn't the best. Like maybe I should have stuck with what I originally was doing. Because that has a little bit more pop and notice to it. Where this... Well, the bad lighting doesn't help, but it's really hard to see in there anyway. <laughs> and, yeah. Eventually, I would love to open a Discord as well when I start getting a community. And I've even thought about having an area where people can post their OCs, and maybe I'd get around to drawing one or two here and there. But that's uh, for the future. If anyone would like that, please let me know. But, yeah, here's the finished product. Uh, you can't even tell, but I did add some glitter on the snowbank. Because for anyone who doesn't have snow in the winter, when it's freshly fallen, it like sparkles. And it's super pretty. But then you have to shovel it, and then it's a pain. But, yeah. So, again, I, I like the concept a lot. Like, I really, really like the concept. I just really don't think the execution of the idea came out well. But let me know what you think down in the comments. Hit the like, hit the subscribe, and have a nice day. Bye!